So I guess is what I'm saying, swat those mosquitoes away first. Uh, bear snacking is uh, not cool in Alaska, and what you need to do is you need to be prepared when you come out here. Uh, there's plenty of bugs, and lo and behold, uh, we left our mosquito dope, so hmm. you're not always prepared. But one thing I want to show you is that if we go right around here and, uh, you know, right there, there's, there's what prepares us for the Alaska bear bush. So just uh, hang on and uh, hopefully we can find something good to shoot, something safe to shoot. I mean, not with the gun, <laughs> with the camera. We're shooting with the camera, but uh, the gun is here for protection just in case. So hopefully uh, we'll find something, you know, if we keep scanning here. Once in a while I see a lot of, a lot of bears pop out right here. There's Mary, she's made her way back, way deep in there. There she is, way up the creek. There she is. Yeah, she's getting that wild spinach all up and down this creek. So, you know, if you guys go outdoors and you look for it, you will find a way to, to feed yourselves and your family. Uh, we get the seag seagull eggs, the duck eggs, uh, myrrh eggs, uh, all sorts of eggs and, and berries and, and fish. So this is what I want to show you. I want to start showing you this with the camera. And this thing is YouTube friendly. So uh, just uh, relax. And uh, we're going to take you to uh, Togi X 2011 salmon fishing season in Birdman's Togi X Alaska. Sour duck. Sour duck, wow. Yeah. They cook them and they eat them. They're like wild um, asparagus. And, and, and then these are wild spinach. Hold, hold. They're really good for you. They're full of vitamins. And we cook them around. They do a little creek. And all, and all you had to do was track around this creek bed a little bit and and there they were. So there is things out there that can feed you. We don't necessarily need uh, to depend on grocery stores. We can uh, look into the, the brush and along the banks and and uh, with a little bit of hard work and effort, uh, dinner's on. There we are. Sour, sour duck right there. And we move this a little bit, you see that little white white flower right there. Uh, if it doesn't fade out, there's a little white flower right down in there. That would be uh, salmon berries. And uh, then around here we just, we've got all these, all, all these other uh, white flowers that are uh, tundra tea. So, it's pretty, pretty exciting, you know, when you, when you think about what you can accomplish by just getting out and enjoying God's country Alaska my knife. hit the brakes because right over here we have wild celery this is wild celery and in a second here Mary's gonna come over and show you how she harvests this and that's a, a real real delicacy so Hang on, we'll give her a chance to get over here. This is kind of an area where we find it, right in here. Mm -hmm. We find wild celery, and here she comes down to, to, uh, oops, there we go. Okay, she's in there getting it. Is it, is, are they good? Oh, there we go. Little one, okay. Put it down. She's gonna go in there and dig some more. That's always worth hitting your skids for. And we're at a new part of this creek right here. And this creek wraps around and uh, right out over there, right there goes out into the bay. And our transportation. Uh, really beautiful beach down there. So, 
So this is where we live. This is what we do. Okay. Yep, that's some wild celery. That's what I'm talking about. Look at the size of those paw prints. And uh, it's a good little area. We got a little section here. Mud bank up the side, the eagles nest up there, and the bears walk this beach right here and go all the way down around that point and the next point and beyond. And uh, there we got eagle feather number two. Mint greens. Mint greens. And you yep. got those way up that hill, right there on the side of the hill? Yeah. Yep. And you're going to get some more. Those mint greens are good in uh, Eskimo ice cream. Uh, Agudak, is that right? Yeah, I eat them with butter and um, um, salt, seal oil. Butter, salt, and seal oil. Amen. And I know you pointed something out to me right over here. This is what I hunt when, when I come out here. Oh, there we get up here, and uh, there's uh, my next eagle feather. There we go. There. Uh, here's what brought those uh, big uh, bear prints that you saw earlier. That, of course, right there is. Uh, a bear spine right up over there. I uh, picked this little trophy up here. Which, uh, and uh, like I said, we're in bear country. Yeah, here we go way down there and uh, there's that Mary up on a hill, uh, harvesting something else. She's way up there, yeah. She's getting some kind of green up there. We'll get a little closer in and a less shaky view. And we'll see what she's up to. Back up the hill. More greens? Right on. Way down, and here we're down on uh, around one of the points. You can kind of see, and we're going around this point here, and uh, on our way that way. And uh, there's the wild celery producer right there, whittling away. This is a uh, Yupik delicacy here, wild celery, and this is. What it looks like in the brush. There it is. Okay. Give you a good look. And our run today was brought to you by absolutely no pebble partnership. No pebble mine. All of it. It's got to go. It's got to go. Okay. Let's see what we got going here. Oh, wow. What we got going here? Little buggy mobile here. This is how the elders travel in Togiak, Alaska. This is Mary's parents. James and Annie. There they go. 